talk about something we haven't talked about in a while. OneNote, Ooh, OneNote. just like all the other Office apps, you can get it on your, your phone, your tablet, your PC, your Mac, what have you. But OneNote is actually a free app. So it's a great l- for all students because when I'm taking my American history class notes here, okay, here I am, I just have my OneNote, which is like a three ring binder. So I'm learning all about the, uh, the, the, the great American experiment. Ooh, democracy and stuff. I'm taking <laughs> notes. I'm taking and notes stuff. in my in my American history class. Okay. But 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 my but my professor speaks so fast. You know, we've all had that kind of professor where they speak so fast and they're so passionate about stuff and you're missing some something important. In one note, I go to insert record audio. Watch and learn. Boop, boop. So I hit record audio, and now you can see audio is recording. I have the little timer up there going. Um, was super important. Okay, folks. Next. Brian is still recording in OneNote, but he is typing <laughs> into typing that field notes. right now Thomas as it's recording. Important. Oh, Mad King George wasn't so happy. Representation. And now I hit stop. And important middle word. Ah. Just like, but okay. So I've recorded the audio. I have the audio file right here in my OneNote file, but that's not what's so impressive. To me, what's so impressive are two things. One, I can go through my notes and there's a little play button that pops up next to my notes. And I can say, ooh, what was the audio that I recorded when I typed the note, Mad King George wasn't happy? Let's hit play and find out. Typing notes. Thomas Jefferson was super important. Um, oh, but you can, can hear see, it. Mad King can you hear it? George. Yeah, you can, hear you can it. see that it's highlighting my notes that I yeah. wrote oh. as the audio plays. This is mm-hmm. game changing for students. This means if you're, if this was a two hour long lecture, I can scroll through and see like, geez, what was it I talked about when we talked about, you know, the Louisiana purchase or whatever. Oh, oh, oh yeah, that's right. Okay, great. That is all right there. And it gets one step mo magico. Mo magico. Hmm. I type audio and video settings right here. And I can select an option that says enable searching audio and video recording for words. So if I click that. Oh, I didn't know about this. If I click that, I say enable audio search. It takes a while. It'll go through all of your all of your audio recordings. And when your computer is idle in the background, it'll start, uh, you know, um, going through it and identifying words and stuff. So I hit OK. And now if I two months later, when it comes time for finals, I can search for the word Louisiana purchase. In my and one, note. and it will come up with the audio recording where the professor said Louisiana Purchase. You didn't write Louisiana Purchase. He you said Louisiana it. Purchase. Yeah, yeah. that's, that's cool. okay. that is the power. That was pretty cool of OneNote. 